Hey there, this is Heather and welcome back to the Sims 4 Legacy Challenge. So as you can see, um, Claire is very old and actually we only have like a couple days left with her. It's probably like two days. Hopefully Max's wife will have the next baby and this is what I came in to the game and had waiting for me. I don't know where all of these gnomes came from. I guess they're the ones that appear on the holiday and then the ones that used to be in the garden. But either way, they have totally trashed the place. So I should probably get rid of them because they're kind of terrible. Gnomes are the worst. Whoop. Let's not remove the floor. And... I guess it would be nice if Audrey would clean up this garbage so that she could get some badge progress, but I think I'll just have her take out the trash and that should be good enough. I think it's going to be Audrey's birthday very soon. Yeah, two days and we have a lot to work on. I don't know if we're going to do as well with Audrey as, uh, as I did with Austin, but Hopefully, we will make some more progress on her values and things like that. And she doesn't have all of the badges. She can collect the arts and crafts one. So she's working on a project right now, but she should do that next. And then civic responsibility, that's cleaning or repair actions. Okay. And she's also going to have to do fishing and programming. But those are not hard because you can just totally choose those ones. What is Austin watching? Is this like Baywatch? I have no idea. It looks like a military thing. I don't know. If you know what that's supposed to be, let me know. I didn't really watch like shows like that ever. So I don't know what it would be. How is your project going, Audrey? What is What like skill is this for? logic skill well that'd be good if austin would help you with that actually because he has oh diamonds are for sims is it supposed to be like a spy movie You're this probably isn't the best room for this project actually can we move this if it requires logic i would think it would be better in the focus room so i'm just gonna Move that in here and have her work carefully on that. And Austin can assist in that room. Claire is like publishing columns and stuff for work and laughing maniacally. She still like never got like a million followers or anything. And she still didn't get charisma level 10. Oh, and she thinks she's going to bed. All right. Well, you are an old lady. You look incredibly old. Incredibly old. Well, she's apparently 131 days old, which I guess is years or whatever. I don't think it's a direct translation, but she's old. Poor Leo. He doesn't like her very much. They are technically lovers and spouse, but... He doesn't even know her third trait. And he doesn't know what her job is. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is freaking hilarious. <laughs> if I wasn't recording that, I think I'd probably just like laugh about that for a couple of minutes. That is so funny. <laughs> he doesn't even know what her job is and he doesn't know what her third trait is. <laughs> what is her third trait? I think it's cheerful. But he doesn't know that about her. Yeah, cheerful. <laughs> he doesn't even know that she's cheerful. He probably doesn't even know that she went to college. <laughs> this is a dysfunctional family. But I think you all know that by now. Nicole, what are you doing? You're chatting with everyone. You're distracting everyone. This is a really annoying thing about her. And I don't know if it's because she's gregarious. It probably isn't, but she just talks a lot. 
dude can you write your book stop talking to them they're working on that project leave them alone focus on your own work and he needs to get oh my gosh he's gonna age up <laughs> today i guess hope he doesn't automatically age up he has three fame points okay well we can't receive gifts in the mail unless I get this one. Maybe we should do that. I don't know that he will actually do any videos, but we can get some free gifts in the mail at least. Wait a minute, I still have one fame point. Well, I'll get noticeable. He should have had that before anyway. It's probably from all the times that he's like flip-flopped out of fame and back into it. Oh, uh, why are you going to view the project? That's unnecessary. Oh, look who's back. It's Claire. Claire, we've been laughing about you and how your husband doesn't know anything about you. Um, You probably don't like that, but why don't you go and practice your speech to finish off your charisma skill? I think that'll probably count for something. And Leo... This book probably isn't that great. Excellent quality, excellent quality, excellent quality. Well, I mean, supposedly they're excellent, so they are like that good, but they're not bestsellers. Okay, excellent, 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 excellent. All of them are excellent and he needs to get bestsellers. This isn't helping me. This isn't helping me at all. I mean, we'll get money for it, but he really needs to get a bestseller. Maybe he should take a moodlet solver. He's only tired though. Well, do we have a sleep replacement? Yeah, he has a sleep replacement. I will have him drink that. Hopefully he won't be as difficult as everyone else when taking potions. Did you drink it? No, you're still tired. You couldn't have taken it. Yes. Oh, what is Austin giggling about? Oh, he's giggling about the snow. <laughs> he's so cute. Okay. Um, Leo, can you like go write a motivational book? You have like a good mood right now. The TV is broken. Austin, this is a job for you. And I know Audrey needs to like work on repairing things and cleaning things, but... She doesn't have any handiness skill at all, and this is dangerous enough as it is. Okay, we'll just call it whatever. Um, I hope he doesn't die. Okay, he got level 3 of handiness, that's good. That was a very fast repair on his part, not very realistic. Also, what are you doing? Why do you need to chat with him? You don't. Audrey's off to school. Nice work, Audrey. Okay, let's take a look at her grade really quick. She has an A. She could be doing better. But she did do her homework and a project, so it will probably go up today. So I'm just going to leave her alone. She can work normally. <clears throat> My voice is a little bit weird today because I'm filming this like right in the morning. Okay, awesome. Throw that away, please. It would be nice if Audrey was here to clean this up. I don't know if that would count as cleaning, though. He's just getting it anyway. She can clean these plates if the maid doesn't do it first, but I think the maid will probably do it first. Okay, Nicole needs to get... Oh. All right. Well, we got the Christmas skill maxed out with Claire, and she can now call her boss to negotiate a promotion. Well, she'll probably get a promotion next time anyway. Wait, is that promotion or a raise? No, it's a promotion. Interesting. I wonder how well that would work. Okay, um, Leo, why don't you get the mail? Because Claire's going to be dead soon, so there's no point in having her hold everything anymore. Wow, we got 5,000 in royalties. That's a lot. 
just stating the obvious with that, but whatever. Okay, let's take down these decorations. It's not Halloween anymore. And in my videos, whatever, this will be the day after Halloween, so no more Halloween, guys. Sorry. Austin, are you being rude? That doesn't seem like him. He doesn't have a career and like he hasn't gone to college. Well, you know what? Maybe Austin should get the mail. Austin. No, not you're not Austin. Austin, get the mail and see if you got accepted into college. Obviously, he got accepted into college, but let's just like get confirmation of that. Okay, he's collected everything from the mailbox. He got some of Claire's potions in here. Happy serum and energy serum. Okay, I don't see anything about college. He still has his teen homework. He doesn't need that. He doesn't need a lot of these things, but whatever. Um, I guess I could put his trophies in his room. So let's do that. That's pretty nice. All of his hard work. And do we really need the sitting out? Probably not. Thought it looked cool, but I don't have it turned on. Well, maybe I could just like put it back and turn it on. Ooh, that seems like it would be dangerous to have that by your computer, actually. Might fry it or something. I don't know how that works. Okay, Leo, are you doing a good job on this? Your fun is not good. Can you play a game? Please? Okay, well, that worked very quickly. Why don't you go back to writing your book? Like, please, God, get a bestseller. Um, Claire, what are you doing? You're going to work. All right. Well, you're not in a good mood at all. You're probably going to come back just like absolutely wrecked, but all right. <laughs> Nicole, did you do all of your homework? Yes, you did. But you do need to work on your paper. Where is that? It's for research and debate, though. Wait, what class is that? Chronicling and memoir? Why don't you study for that class? Where is your research and debate? It's only level three, but we're almost to level four. Okay, and Leo, do you have any skills maxed out? Writing. Well, I should have known that one. And he doesn't even have fitness maxed out. How is that even possible? He works out literally every day by himself without me even having to tell him, but it's not maxed out. And he's almost an elder. What is up with these Sims? Audrey's having a tough time. Uh-oh, she's passing out at school. That is not good. How did that happen? When she gets home, she's gonna have to go to sleep. No, she can't. She's gonna have to take a sleep replacement because she has too many things to work on. Actually, probably would have been better if I had her not go to school. I think tomorrow she's not going to go to school. She's going to have to take a day off and do volunteering instead. Okay, he has finished a book. Where is that? It's a bestseller. Oh, thank God. Okay, why don't you talk to Austin and get your social up? Talk about your dreams. Give family advice. Compliment his outfit, because it's a pretty cool outfit. Ask about his future plans. Brighten his day. Talk about handiness, because both of you are into that. Discuss hydration. What else can you talk about? You could ask him about his favorite author. And you better not tell him it has to be you. And let's see. We could have a deep conversation with him. Austin, as much as I love you, that's not the gaming room. It's not the gaming room, Austin. You need to get off that computer so that your father can write a book. Okay, I guess we're going to write a motivational book. Mind over muscle. Okay. 
Nicole's class starts in about one hour. And that was probably a while ago. Oh, no, she put her book away. Nicole, why were you in your parents' room in the first place? How did you get in there? I mean, it's not locked, but maybe it should be. Where is it? She just leaves her stuff, like, everywhere. Even though it's favorited, that doesn't help. And her homework is missing as well. It was missing when I came into the game today. She just, like, puts it all over the place. I don't know. I wonder if there's a mod that will have people keep their homework in their inventory. Like, the way that she does that just drives me crazy. Which you can probably tell. Is there any... There were two homeworks. And it was by the pool last time, but I don't see it there now. Okay, well, whatever. Get to class, Nicole, so I can tell you to take notes. Class is probably going to be, like, over by the time she gets there. Oh, great. It ends at 2.55. Are you kidding me? You're just like, she's walking so slow that she's only going to be there for 10 minutes. Well, this probably screwed up her grade. She's going to have to email her teacher and see if that helps anything at all. But she's got this other class. She wasn't prepared. Yeah, we all know. We all know how it wasn't or how not prepared she was. Oh, look, it's Max. And Audrey's back. Nicole, go to class. She drives me crazy sometimes. Oh. Oh. Um. Okay. So. Clara's throwing a fit. At work. Um. Alright, I'm just gonna give her... Wait a minute. Stop doing that. Go to work. And let's get this moodlet solver out. I don't really want her to stop being sad necessarily because she could write in her journal about that, but we really do have other stuff to do. And yeah, so two days and she ages up. She needs to go volunteering right away. She's going to ask Austin for advice. Well, I guess no one else is here. And Leo needs to work hard. Are you going to actually drink that? No, she's not going to ask for advice anymore. Okay. And yeah, she needs to clean and fish and do programming but I think it would be good if they both went volunteering you can both go volunteering Austin is an empathetic person he would definitely go why don't you volunteer at a nursing home be nice to the old people otherwise it will defeat the purpose of this oh look it's Nicole Oh, God, Nicole. I don't know why you couldn't go to class on time. I do not know. Well, wait, what class was that that you messed up? Filling notebooks. Okay, well, you're going to have to email that teacher and apologize for being late and see if they will... Uh. Support the better product, Leo. What did that say? You want to know how you're doing in the class? You're doing fine. Stay on top of your homework. Well, what is she doing? She thinks she's going to go play Blick Block. Well, you're kind of wrong, Nicole. You're kind of wrong. There will be no Blick Block for you. 
and Claire brought home 5,000 more simoleons. An elderly Sim grabs Audrey's arm and starts telling her stories about his youth. Well, you're supposed to be getting empathy, so listen to his stories. Audrey was trapped into a long conversation with the elderly Sim. It's weird how that's capitalized. And was so bored that she fell asleep. When she woke up, there was a note from the elderly Sim. Didn't anyone ever teach you it's rude to nap when others are talking? Okay, well, that's not my fault. She took a moolet solver and she was not tired. So, how could I have known she would fall asleep? Obviously, I couldn't. Oh. Nicole, stay out of your parents' room, you freaking weirdo. You do not need to observe that and become flirty. This is annoying. Okay, Claire can lock the door. Lock door for everyone but Claire. And allow access. Well, Leo's not here. Unlock for specific sim. Well, he's not here right now, so we can't even do it. Honestly, I don't think he would really care if he couldn't even go back in there. Because <laughs> he doesn't even, like, really know her. Um, Max's letter. Claire's letter. Nicole's letter. Austin! Has a letter. Well, can't give it to him right now. Um, no, that's Claire. I keep getting them mixed up. This is Nicole's letter. So she has Max's letter. Dude, why are you standing out here like this? Why? Um, take a shower. And go to sleep. Claire's freezing to death. Well, she'll be inside in a second. Yeah, she's not blue anymore. We've got the heat on. It's amazing how quick they can freeze to death. I don't know how long she was out there, but I feel like that's kind of ridiculous. And we have a seed packet. Um, okay, now what are you doing? You're researching workout tips. I feel like that's not what you should be doing. Like maybe you should do the homework for the class that you basically skipped and then work on the other one. That seems about right. And what is this selling a story class? What skill is that? Charisma. Okay, well, you could do that in the charisma room then. I don't know if the mood light will help with this or not, but it couldn't hurt, so. I kind of wish the Austin, okay, they're back. I was about to say, I kind of wish Austin would come back. Um, Austin, how did you get negative manners from this? I don't understand that, but let's get your letter out. Austin's letter. Okay, Austin, why don't you read your letter? Obviously, you got in. And I feel like he would want to do something with science because he wants to be handy and logical. So I feel like he would want to be a scientist. So maybe he should go to Foxbury Institute instead of where everyone else has gone because that makes sense. All right, university, let's, well, can, what scholarships can we apply for? Are there any more that we haven't applied for? And Audrey, did you get any empathy from this? You did get some empathy. I don't know if it's like even worth like having her pursue that because I feel like she's just not going to get it. Austin is clearly the best child. His sisters are a lot cuter, but he has much better character. Okay, he can also apply to this one for handiness. I don't know if he will get that one. Let's Check your scholarship applications. Uh -huh. Not that he has to get them because we'll just pay for it otherwise. If 
not in school is stupid can i never go to school again um no unfortunately you're never going to school again but he didn't get the athletics one that's sad i wanted him to be on the soccer team he got the super scout one and whatever but okay let's well you know what Let's have him work out, actually. Austin, I care about you more than all of the other ones. Don't ask me why. Just, well, it's because you're nice. That's what it is. Leah, why are you standing out here? You know that you have things to do, right? Like writing novels. He needs to play a game. Wait. When do you have work again? 17 hours. You need to study opponents instead. So, do that. I wish studying opponents didn't take as long as it does, but he's going to be sitting there all night. Okay, and Austin is going to work out. Audrey, you are not, absolutely not, going to be playing video games. Just not going to do it. You're not going to do your homework either. We need to find something for you to clean. Um... I guess you're going to have to make a mess, so get leftovers. Unfortunately, the maid kind of prevents us from needing to clean when we actually do need to clean for some reason. I guess I could have fired the maid, but then I would just have to rehire them again later. Ugh, what is that? Is that like baked beans? Or is that stopping? With a lump of tofu shaped like a turkey leg. Ugh. Austin, how did you reach parenting level one? When did that happen? Is it from watching TV? It doesn't make sense. How would you... How would you get parenting skill from watching an action movie? Or an action TV show. That makes no sense. I don't know if this is going to count as cleaning when she cleans it up. Okay, you don't actually really even need to eat this. Can you just clean it up? Okay, well that did count for cleaning. Um, what do you think you're doing now? You're not going to chat with Austin. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. You are going to go volunteer again by yourself this time. And you can go back to the nursing home and try not to mess it up this time. You don't want to get on my bad side, Audrey. That's what Nicole has done. That's what Nicole has done. I don't know which one of you is going to be the heir. Might be Austin. It might be Austin. Okay, he's reached fitness level four. I would like to get him on the soccer team. But we need to get him in better shape, I think. Because he's not in very good shape. And then he might need to get some muscle. We'll see. Nicole, are you done with that yet? Wow. All right. Well, she's 50% done. Leo, how long have you been sitting here? And you're still not done with studying opponents. You've just been doing this one task the whole time. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> He's giggling about cupcakes. That's interesting. I mean, I don't know if it's actually interesting. It's just kind of weird. Austin, don't go to that. Leo aged up. Oh, no. He didn't get it. I forgot it. I forgot he was about to age up. Look at him. Ugh. 
Leo, what has happened to you? I swear you got skinnier. Now he's an old man. He'll probably never get promoted. Ageism. He'll never get promoted. They'll be like, no, that old guy can't play. He'll probably get hurt. Dude, look at that old guy. Who does he think he is? I wonder if they would say that to David Beckham when he gets old. Okay, let's try this again and see if she can not sleep. Okay, Audrey patiently listened to the elderly Sim stories and found that the elderly Sim had a lot of interesting adventures in his younger days. She really enjoyed the conversation. Okay, well, she gained some empathy and social this time. Max has sent Leo a gift. Well, that's good. We did give Max 20,000 simoleons that we didn't owe him. Nicole, what are you doing? You are stinky. Take a shower. And Audrey's still volunteering. Austin is sleeping. It would be nice if he could work out some more. But he's too tired. And that bed's probably not as good. Oh, we did upgrade that one, but it's probably not as good as everyone else's bed. Claire, you can get up. Just wake up. And get some leftovers. Poor Leo is really sad about his birthday. Because I forgot about it. Oh, well. He'll get over it. Let's write... I guess we can't write a sad book. Well, what can we do to cheer him up? He's sleeping on the couch. Yeah, his relationship's not so fantastic. That's pretty obvious at this point. Don't worry, Leo, she'll be dead soon. <laughs> she will be dead soon. And then you can get away from her. Oh. Audrey's like there for a while. How much empathy is this getting us? Not that much. I don't think we're going to get empathy. That's unfortunate. She's just going to get responsible in manners. Like Austin is just like the golden child. I don't really know how you could argue with that. I mean, he might be paranoid, but everything else about him is fantastic. And honestly, the paranoia is kind of cute because he looks around in that weird way and continually changes his passwords. It's pretty funny. Hopefully we can at least get Audrey the badges, which we should be able to do. Nicole, what are you doing right now? You're playing Blick Block. What am I doing? I'm just like hanging out with these Sims or something instead of... Instead of actually, like, steering this video. You know what? I don't even know. It's it's early, like I said before. Let's study for that class that you missed the other day or yesterday or whatever. Okay, so she got some empathy. Alright, well, she might actually be able to get this then. She got more than I thought. This time go to a soup kitchen again. People who are actually in need, need some empathetic people in their life. Okay, she's studying. Poor Leo, why are you still sleeping there? Didn't I tell you? Oh, that's why. That's why he's sleeping there. It's not because of his poor relationship. It's because... He, whatchamacallit, is locked out of the room, which makes sense. Okay. Claire, you can just leave that bowl there for Audrey to clean up. She's going to die in like one day. What else can you... Wait a minute. Oh, wait, this is your old homework. Well... You don't need it. And actually, what is this? A fine arts university court. Well, we need that for someone else in the future. We don't need 
Well, these are Austin's letters, so he can have them. He can throw them away if he wants to. Why don't you list this on Plopsy? And then list these other things on Plopsy. Oh my gosh, they were made by they were made by my sim cell. Just list them on Plopsy anyway. Obviously, um, we are not going to get rid of this teal baby onesie. That will never happen. I really don't like the way that they disappear when babies age up, though. That's not good. Austin, do you want a tablet? Your mother's about to die. <laughs> uh. And we should probably put her degree in the basement. Well, it is pretty sad. Give these photos to Leo. We'll give her degree to Leo because she doesn't need it. Max. Well, we don't need her letter anymore. I mean, you can't hang these up, so. We don't need Max's either. She could just like drag all of these things, like multi select, and then put it in someone else's inventory, but I don't think that works. And actually, we should get that like bulletin board. No, that's not what I want. I want this one. Postcard cork board. We'll put it here. And then we can put this postcard. It's a rare postcard. Ooh. Well, call the power company. Same thing as that other time. And it worked out. Okay. Nicole, how is your skill getting? Or how is it going? Whatever. Um, mm -hmm. What is this for? I think it's research and debate she's doing. But it doesn't say anything to indicate that right here. Austin, are you still tired? No. Get some leftovers. Hopefully he won't clean up. Because Audrey needs to clean up. But Audrey might just have to make a mess and then clean that up. Claire, you are so old. You are so old. Well, I guess you will have to die in the next part because... I don't have enough time for that left in this stuff in this episode. So yeah. All right. I'm going to leave this one here and I will talk to you in the next part. Please like the video, subscribe to my channel and leave me comments, especially about who you think the heir should be. I kind of think it should be Austin because Austin is just, he has much better character than everyone else. But let me know what you think. And yep. Bye.